Hello everyone and welcome to Smash Chat and today we have Joker. Hello. Smash Mario Pro 2000. Hello. Sonic Sceptile Warrior. Howdy. And Sub-07. I called the plumber. The leak should be fixed soon. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid the plumber has gone on to be a rapper. Uh, going to this leak. <laughs> yeah. Is that what we're calling this one? The rapper Mario? The, the... And the Mario is in the building. <laughs> How many times must we leak this data, old man? <laughs> of course the plumber would leak something. I mean, he hasn't been a plumber. He got fired. He came back. I mean, For some reason, he came plumber. back. He's like, he what? Make up your God. mind, Nintendo. I mean, with how many times Mario has died in a trailer, of course he's going to leak anything. Because he's like, I want nothing to do with this company anymore. Look, that's why you have stunt doubles. <laughs> like Luigi. He's oh, already yeah, dead. Luigi. He's okay. <laughs> yeah, Luigi, Luigi's dead. Luigi's remember. okay, guys. He's okay, we promise. <laughs> it's not like his soul got reached out by death itself, but he's okay, guys. Don't worry. <laughs> back in the body at the end. Just but a scratch. Okay, so moving on to this leak. Oh, my gosh. Like, I honestly don't. I, I actually really like this leak for a number of reasons, but it has a, a great deal of red flags to it. So let's go over it bit by bit. First of all, this was posted Tuesday, January 26th of this year of 2021. And just to double check that, I checked my calendar. Yes, it was a it was a Tuesday on the on January 26th. So that's not fabricated. It was Tuesday. It was Taco Tuesday. They fooled us all. And apparently, uh, Smash Mario Pro, who is the one that sent this to me, also found the original post. It doesn't look like it's, like, uh, fabricated? It doesn't look like it's photoshopped? It yeah, looks... the comments definitely suggest that it is real with the whole disbelief of them. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm not... I think I might have to censor a few of those words there. Literally, yeah. first response tell him to get out. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, pretty much. Okay, get in. <laughs> okay, so... Let's finally get into this one. He starts off... I mean, this is like the big red flag right away. I just want to be one of the greats, bros. I want to be up there with the ESRB leaker. I don't have anything I can show without compromising the identity of my source, but I'm tired of staying silent. You know, when you're a leaker, maybe you should just leak this stuff and don't say anything. Yeah. Just this drop it and run. The younger brother of the person who actually has the data. Yeah, the arrogance yeah. of this person really shows. I don't know if this is arrogance so much as just like, I want to be the center of attention. Ugh. We see this almost all the time. In fact, the last one is also another red flag. And uh, it says, I will not be returning here, and I probably won't be getting more info unless this post goes under the radar. I am familiar with the uh, beckons for visual proof or concrete statements for the for the further future, but those are both risky in their own regards. I know I'll be vindicated when my timeline plays out as written. See you later. Like, once again, I know I'll be vindicated when my timeline plays out. It's like, we say this one all the time with these leakers. Like, yeah, it's, yeah, it's a, it's a way to like, that way they can easily back out like, oh, I must have misheard something or, oh, I didn't, oh, I knew about that, but well, I just must have changed it part way through development and without telling me. Who yeah, I mean, look yeah. what happened with the Gamatsu leak. They yeah. said Prom, even though he was, we know he was planned, but he got replaced by Robin. Mm -hmm. And then later turned into an Echo. Yes. Yeah. Well, he got it. so Gamatsu was technically right. Just four years later. later. So yeah. Four years later. They had the information. It seemed like they had the information right as soon as the game started development, and that was it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but for this guy, okay. Uh, once again, this is back in January. The first thing he says is the next character will be revealed this time next month, not in a Smash Direct, but a Nintendo presentation nonetheless. Now it says next. This time next month, he's a little off. Uh, yeah, it's just yeah. A, it's a little off. However, he is right. It was a Nintendo presentation. It wasn't a Smash Direct, which you know we hadn't had a real Nintendo Direct in a very long time. So that was kind of a risky guess right there. Although I think a lot of people were just saying, "Oh yeah, there's going to be a Direct eventually," and everyone just assumed February because that's when they usually drop off. It's either late January or early February when they drop off a Direct. Well, you don't put anything in January. That's a dead zone for companies. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Although Nintendo has done Jan uh, January Directs. Or at least you don't put, like, new releases in January because yeah. they want to spend their money in December. Yep. Yeah. We need a month to recover. 
That's not all he had to say about this one though. He said, This character will appease audiences both East and West, but it won't break the internet and a fair amount of people will be angry at their inclusion. I mean, that's like, that that's like saying literally... water is wet. It's, that can it's literally inevitable. apply to any character at all because some people are going to be happy, some people are going to be upset. That's literally every character. Some more than others. Is not very... He's not wrong, yeah, but that's such a vague guess that, yeah, you got you got that right. But however, I do I do like how he said it won't break the internet. They 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 didn't. So yeah, good point. I mean, at the same time, though, this this is like the most privileged statement of just <laughs> oh yeah, you guys get yet another character that people love. You're still gonna hate it. Yeah, because that's yes. Smash. Yeah, yeah that, that's Smash. That, 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 that's Smash. We give you everything and you spit in our face. <laughs> we gave you the banjo. And you guys still don't like it. More gimmicks, less gimmicks, more inputs. Perfect! What? I hate Smash Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I love that Courage the Kelly, Cowardly yeah. Dog reference. I uh, hate macaroni. <laughs> uh, now, macaroni. it does say the next one, or like, it doesn't say the timing of when it is, but I think we all figured it was going to be E3, so who cares about that. Uh, it says, yeah. the next is a less expected rep of a beloved third-party series already in Smash. Many people thought this series would receive more representation in the base game. Now... There's a number of little tiny words here that yield a great deal of detail. It, the next is a less expected rep of a beloved third-party series. I don't think anybody was guessing Tekken. Tekken yeah, is beloved in the yeah, fighting that, game community, but, yeah. it, but it definitely wasn't expected. No, yeah, yeah. Still, especially after Heihachi got me costume. I thought every, I think yeah. everyone just thought, oh yeah, that's all Tekken's going to well, get. No, pe people were still like holding out for maybe Jin, but Kazuya was unexpected. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, and it does have representation in the base game, if by just the little Hayachi thing in Pac-Man's taunt. Like, mm -hmm. that's so little. But if you really think about it, what other character... Like, the only character who even got an extra rep uh, that was already in the base game was Sephiroth. Many people were probably thinking it was going to be Eggman next. But mm -hmm. no, it does... But, do, but everybody was saying... Eggman. However, the guy says less expected rep of a beloved third party. Less expected is the key word there. Because, once yeah. again, I mean, nobody was expecting Tekken. Yeah. Like, Tekken in, like, the Smash community is, like, more of a, like, hey, you get one me costume, go home. <laughs> no, I believe the correct answer is it's a fighting game that isn't Smash. Get out of here, said the Smash. <laughs> I remember yeah. when people, I saw some people saying Tekken is an obscure series. I'm like, how do you what? even... Tekken has uh, been around longer yeah, than Smash. Like, get out. That, that, like that one iceberg. Oh, uh, like, no. Don't remember that iceberg. Uh, that, that, is like, that is like the definition of the stereotype Smash players only play Smash. They it, only play yeah. Smash. I'm kind of guilty, but I have been playing Killer Instinct and. You um, at least like are aware of the other ones. Yeah, yeah. You're at least at aware least of aware. the other games. Yeah. I've played a lot of yeah. them, but I'm bad at all of them. Now, before we go on to who he says the next character is, he does say Dante is a me costume, lol, and so is Monster oh. Hunter. Uh, <laughs> uh, Monster Hunter could have been a bit of a safe uh, bet because Monster Hunter was in the yeah, last Monster game. Monster Hunter was, yeah. yeah, Monster Hunter did have me costumes, and we were gradually getting uh, returning me costumes at this rate, so it's also something at the lowest as a boss slash assist. It makes sense. Yeah, so uh, that like lol part is like a red flag me i'm like are really? you sure because oh, i mean like he's not, really staying it right there dante is a me costume lol <laughs> like, yeah he, he's oh, specifically no, 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 calling he's really... out he's specifically calling out this and i think he's taunting them which is not a good which you do not want to do unless you are like 100 percent correct yeah but he was I mean, I mean, he was which is well, there you go very cocky this just saying uh yeah the monster hunter we kind of expected it but there were other leaks that were going around, like the whole anniversary or the concert leak. That's oh, yeah. That it was going to be Monster oh, yeah. Hunter. So this beat that out. Just saying. It, it has its guns. Now, it's saying that was pretty much... Okay, no. Wait, wait, wait. There is one more thing before we go on to the stuff that hasn't been shown yet. Oh, yeah. There it is. The second fighter pass has a bonus character from Zelda that will release alongside or shortly after the final character. This is months before we found, what was it, the Australian site that kind of leaked a potential bonus character? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because... Yeah. Because I, I was think like... What character was it? We don't know. We, we don't, don't know. know. It was just a glitch on the Gosh. website that said, like, uh, there's going to be stuff there added later on. 
yeah. When uh, when if you type in other numbers, it gets you to just an error message. I mean, mm -hmm. like, what is it? Like the eleventh fighter, the blank fighter, and then the me costume. Yeah. 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 So there is like it was like seventy four, I think. Okay, I want to make this little note while I'm editing the video. I was wrong. It's actually seventy three, not seventy four. So when you hear me say seventy four, just replace it with seventy three. Just wanted to correct myself before I got sworn by comments saying that. Really does indicate that something is supposed to be coming. We don't know what it is. It could be a stage. It might be like maybe like some pathetic new mode that no one's gonna care about. It could be a maybe they're bringing back more of the platforms. That would be nice. How's that stay board the platforms? If if or they even made no, even better back smash run. Yes. 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 I was just about yes. to say that. Yes. Uh, I would so definitely pay money for Smash Run. Oh yeah. Same. Like five bucks. With more stages than just the one we got in 3DS. Unfortunately, what happened was the intern forgot a semicolon in the code. <laughs> oh, oh. If you've oh, been coding, God. you know how that feels. Oh. Uh, yeah, I've, I've dabbled in coding. I know. Uh, it sucks. I coders, my, my program that. doesn't work. Why? Coders, my program works. Why? Ah, <laughs> uh. <laughs> we, we just don't know. Okay, so uh, the thing is, like, most of based on the pattern that's been going on, everybody is saying like it's most likely either gonna be a me costume or it could be a potential fighter. It could be an echo of a fighter that we're getting, or it could be like a bonus character, much like how Piranha Plant started it, and this character would end it. And this leak is basically saying this before we found out anything concrete about it, like any kind of speculation on it. So, yeah. I will give... Very much. Like, this guy has gotten a number of things right. He's been kind of vague, or whoever this person is. I keep saying he. It could be whatever. Daryl. Uh, them. They, them. Cheryl. Uh, They've gotten a number of things right. They haven't really gotten anything wrong. It's been too vague, but there is a great deal of, like, the stuff that they have said directly has been correct, which... Hmm... The only thing that's yeah. really wrong with this leak so far is that Sakurai himself has said that there is going to be no more DLC after this, but, I mean, it's Sakurai. My my thing is, uh, with that, is, like, in the original showcase of Fire Pass 2, there was a specific animation for Eleven, and Sakurai is, like, now he's making sure, like, Eleven is the last one, so he's, like, making, like, Eleven, like, this big deal, in a way. And I believe that, because... I think we're gonna, like, uh, he could be potentially showing off a potential bonus character, so there's that. Whatever happens, it's gonna pretty much make internet history. Yeah. yeah. How do you feel about Blue Mario? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, yeah, it feels like that's the only thing. Uh, it's very possible that during all this, Nintendo reached a new negotiations deal with Sakurai, and he's like, okay, fine, I'll take the money, bring in more companies. Yeah. Yeah. But the thing is, like, we don't know how far in advance this was made because when it comes to stuff like, uh, um, in Fire Pass 2, like, that was made in November as confirmed by Sakurai because that was when he recorded the Byleth presentation. Even though it was, even though it was uploaded in January, he re it was pre-recorded. But we don't know, like, how in advance this bonus fighter was like planned about if it is real of course plus seven months is a long time in development and things could change oh, yeah. yeah now i mean he, he i mean he could have gone in and changed it but i think he actually wants us to be on the mindset of yes there's one more character and then bam blow our expectations away well, right i think it's the also water. worth noting is when the kazuya presentation was recorded because in the e3 presentation he specifically said he hadn't recorded it yet and he said at the end it'd be the last fire that was during so if he recorded it this month then he must know that yeah it fire pass 11 may be the last character unless he truly is just trolling us which it's kind of hard to think that because he's been saying fire pass 2 is it for almost a year now right i feel like it's not enough evidence that he would do an ed boon on us just yet <laughs> yeah <laughs> Well, I do but have a... Anyone who's a troll for fighting games, it's either Ed Boon or Ono, oh no, but Ono oh doesn't work here anymore, so that's fine. I do have, like, a tinfoil hat theory, but we'll get to that later. Tinfoil hat? Who are you, Papa Gino's? <laughs> <laughs> All great hat. spectators have those. <laughs> I want your hat. 
Uh, Didn't the leak say it would be a Zelda character? Yes, it did yeah. say it would be a Zelda character, and that makes a ton of sense, because if it was going to be a bonus character, it more than likely was going to be a first-party character. I was thinking it would either be Bandana Waddle Dee or Dixie Kong, but as... I have... Honestly, Zelda needs a new rep at this point. Yeah, as long as it's not another Dixie Link Kong. Zelda, okay? I had a Deku Link. Speaking <laughs> of, no. of Dixie Kong, I remember Kong. the Forbidden 7 from Brawl? I feel like if it's anyone, it would probably be the four champions, simply because Sakurai could make the argument, oh, you're getting four characters for one pass, like he did with... Uh, uh, Mithra and Pyra. Yeah. It's a bit of a high concept yeah. character to have four and one, though. Mithra and Pyra is just two and one. That's stretching it. Yeah. Like, oh, it is. Like, and, it, but I mean, would we be can, okay. We have three and one uh, with Pokemon Trainer, so it's. Yeah, but we also already had the assets for that. Yeah, but like, also, yeah, but, like okay. If, maybe the special if, button is how you switch between them, like you, like Shulk's Minato. Yeah, I was about to say, like, how yeah. would, like, the champions work? Hyrule like, Warriors. In a sense. Yeah. Hyrule Warriors. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but here, but then I just had another thought, and it scares me. Uh, those Sub Zero might like this. What if that Zelda character to promote Skyward Sword HD is Fi? <laughs> oh uh, no! I, don't really, I doubt it. I doubt it. No, 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 it. It would probably be Breath of the Wild two in relation in some way. Yes, I no, agree. No, but I think Champions two. definitely fits better, and it would give us so many more Zelda characters. No, no, yeah. no even better. We add. They add Gooks. Bruce, whatever his name is, and his, and his, his entrance animation to go, he didn't make it. His entrance animation has to be like he he grabs on the link and then goes down to the world. Please, <laughs> actually, I would have thought he'd just like jump in and comb his hair up. Remember? I'm sorry, <laughs> but yeah, I like that. Uh, I like that idea way better. Uh, I was okay. thinking a different Zelda villain. Remember Vadi from the Minish Cap? Yes, 15 years ago. Uh, but uh, <laughs> oh. I don't really think mm. they really I'm, care about the Four Swords storyline anymore. That was mostly done by Capcom. I'd sooner mm -hmm. anticipate Majora, what? if anything, but I doubt that. Yeah. Ooh, yeah, upgraded. Yeah, I like it. Majora's, Majora's already a assist trophy. Upgrade him! Upgrade him! We upgraded Little Mac after Brawl. Who knows? Yeah. Well, I mean, uh... An upgrade... Me, uh, not me costumes. Uh, assist trophies mid-game. Yeah, they haven't done that yet. Keyword yet. yet. And we're getting later on into the leak about that, but uh, th the thing I liked about this leak so far is that they've never told us who the characters are, which is actually safe to, uh, that way they don't get caught. Like, it's too vague. But this one, they don't say the name, but if you can give me any other character that fits this bill, I'm all ears. The Final Fighter is a Capcom character from a game that doesn't involve action. I don't know about you, but Resident Evil's not action, it's just horror, so... Leon. Think, <laughs> I'd be okay I with think that. it might be uh, <laughs> Phoenix Wright, though, because... Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, that's the obvious pick. Yeah. Okay. yeah. If, if it good. lines up to, to what it actually is. Okay, yeah. Plus, Plus, Sakurai might want to like try to represent the visual novel, because he did want to do a, a Yumi Tachibana, which was from a visual novel, so he might... It, and it correlates to what Fire Pass 2 has been. Ooh. Ideas that he had before coming back. So, him doing a visual novel character like Ace Attorney would be a great way to Wait. get back to that. Okay, Wait no, a minute. No. Okay, hold well, on. That could also Here, mean he might want to do a pure standalone horror character, Leon confirmed. Objection! <laughs> okay, hold on. There's a different Capcom series with no action. What? Remember a little DS game called Ghost Trick? Oh, yeah. No, because Capcom sure does not remember that series. <laughs> <laughs> no, okay, uh, yeah. well, and that's just kind of why it feels like Phoenix Wright fits way better. Like, a lot of people, there are people that would love this to be a thing. Uh, Smash Mario Pro, he's one of your most requested I would, characters. I would love Phoenix. Uh, uh, yeah, AP on. Greenest would love Phoenix Wright, and I'm pretty sure Ant Dude would love Phoenix Wright, so... there's a I would love Phoenix Wright, never even played his games. <laughs> like, PW has a lot of history with Nintendo. He's only been on Nintendo consoles for all of his titles, even if we didn't get all of them in America. I know. But... Okay. Actually, I thought some of them were ported to the other consoles. I know. They, they were ported, but they always started here. Okay. okay. I know. Okay. Oh, hold on. No, here's a little bit of a controversial opinion. I, if Phoenix Wright get, gets in, I would not be happy. Oh, like, oh. I, uh -oh. Why? Like, you don't, you don't like would, joke no. slash more high concept characters like how he's in Marvel Three? Yeah, no. I think he would be uh, changed. Like if he, yeah, I think he would be like unique from Marvel 
versus Capcom because, like, look at Mega Man. He's not like he is in Marvel versus Capcom. Right. Too, or so. Street Fighter versus Tekken. Don't talk uh, about that we one. We don't it talk happened. about that Mega Man. <laughs> That's a different one. And we left Wait, him on the side of the road where he belongs. We left that for memory behind us for a reason. You will never be a memory. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Just, wait. I... Just wait until Tekken X Street Fighter. He'll be back. Oh god. <laughs> now, okay, so moving on, it does say there will be no third pass, but there'll be a playful statement in the final presentation saying not to be surprised if more content randomly drops. Considering that Sakurai has been saying this is it, this is it, this is it, and then he says, oh, by the way, don't be surprised if there's more. Like, wait, that would just come out of nowhere. That's just like, what? <laughs> well, I actually us. have an issue with that statement because, first of all, it's not recorded yet. So it's not like in stone that he would say that. Because if, if the Kazuya's presentation wasn't recorded beforehand, then the last character sure as heck wasn't by this point. Unless this and... is the guy that's been writing up his presentations. <laughs> yeah, it is. That would be very amazing. But I don't think that would be the right, but we'll just have to see. But yeah. I'm, that's like the one statement out of this whole league that was like, that's kind of sus. Yeah. I mean, I mean, they, I mean, they could be making like the 11th character right now as we speak. They are. Yeah, they are. They are absolutely. Uh, the thing is, are they making that and the bonus character? And maybe that's why it may be a little bit more time before they can show it off? That is something worth noting, though. Of course, that's... I okay, mean, that's also going... That's assuming that we are getting a bonus character. I keep forgetting... Yeah. Like, I have to For keep mentioning it's a last potential... Character is another high yeah. concept character. Yeah, it's a potential that's bonus right. character. We don't know they for might, sure. That might be all hands on deck for them, like what they did for Steve. I mean, we also yeah. have, like, the three-month pattern. Yeah, like, but I get the feeling, like, like, it might be yeah. a little bit later than that. Because it, well, it's hard to say. Sakurai makes patterns and then he breaks patterns. It's it's just well, a throw us off. Yeah. And everyone knows I, the sequence. It's yeah. got to change up somehow. Yeah. yeah, but like since Sephiroth, like I guess since there was a pattern, I was noticing like like, like hmm, there's gonna be another fighter sometime in March. I Do think. Oh yeah. I think um, at the earliest there's gonna be a Nintendo Direct in September. That's when they're gonna show it. Not necessarily released in September, but like that's when we'll show who it is. Yeah, right. like they they show it like they show it off every three months, not release three months. Yeah. And Which if it's Phoenix, fine. good lord, the internet is going to basically become a nuke shelter. Sakurai, yeah, but Sakurai but... breeds. Internet explodes. <laughs> hey, hey, me and my friends are going to be popping off because play. my friends like Konar. Oh, he's going to be loving it every second of it. It's like Phoenix is his most wanted, so he's going to be loving it. So I, I wonder uh, how yeah, he but, feels about this. Is boy. he basically saying, "Don't you dare give me hope! Don't you dare give me hope!" Still, though, like Sakurai being a, having a playful statement, though, like he does do those things, and he's always yeah. been known to like near the end of a direct, he's like, "Okay, that's it," and then after that, he shows a trailer for a new character. Oh, what was that? Shakes the ground, King K. Rule. Yes, and this goes all. The, like, this even goes all the way back to like uh, 3DS and Wii U when he was also saying yeah. like, "Oh, what about Zero Suit Samus?" Well, unfortunately, she won't be in this game. Nah, I'm only kidding. Just nah. I'm only kidding. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's a troll, but he's the best troll you could ever hope for. Like he he lowers your expectations only to blow them away. He's the troll that says he forgot to buy you ice cream and then gives you a Sunday. Yeah. Yep. He's the person that asks you what Switch games you have and buys you Splatoon 2. <laughs> and then he buys you a second copy for no reason. Ah, I, I see what you did there. Very nice. <laughs> I, honestly, it feels like, yeah, if it wasn't for the fact that Sakurai himself has been saying, this is it, this is it, this is it, this is it, I mean, it, it's like, yeah, you could still be a bit doubtful, but it's still his word, and you kind of want to take that as a fact, because the poor man deserves a break, but at the same time, it's... He, he has that playful nature to him, so he could be setting us up to think this is it, and then BAM! Here's more! Internet explodes! More hype! More money! That might also be him trying to cover his bases, because he knows if he just yeah, says it yeah. once, the internet will just be like, yeah, whatever. This is him just yeah. like, please, stop I mean, moving everything. Is, I, yeah. I mean, I mean like, let's not forget, he's been he stated over and over that non-video game characters can't get in, but people still want Goku. So. Uh, and SpongeBob. Lots of people being stubborn. Yeah. 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 I mean, you already got him in the game. His name's Hero. <laughs> that was Lucario. I mean, I mean, the man needs a break. He's been, 
Yeah, Sakurai's been working been like at this for ten that's, years now. Yeah, but that's why I'd be okay with because he says uh, not to be surprised if content randomly drops. Like we don't know when that content could drop. It'd be going back to like the days of 3DS and Wii U, and we had no idea when the DLC was going to drop. So if he's yeah. able to take a break, take a break, and and then Man, if this is true, breathe. he comes back and just more stuff falls into our laps. <laughs> Six year vacation. When it comes back, it's a new Star Fox game. What? <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> no, no, even better. Kid Icarus and Star Fox game. No, it hasn't been Cross 25 over. years yet. Okay, the next part is it says companies slash studios I know are involved with the rest of Past 2 and beyond. Now, this is important. He says I know. That doesn't mean he knows all of it. These are just the ones he knows because there's a specific company here he did not mention. And this I actually do like because it means. He doesn't know everything, because that also means that there might be a few companies here that we would like to see that aren't listed that could still show up. Like yours for breakfast. Keep no. having hope, man. Keep having hope. <laughs> <laughs> if Sean Kay did not get in as a character, you're not getting Hat Kid. I can dream, Harold. <laughs> Here's what it has to say. And remember, this is dating back all the way to January. Activision, which is a good sign for Crash. Cash for Nuka intensifies. <laughs> okay, the next one. We can all cringe. Epic. Uh, <laughs> Fortnite uh, streamers rejoice. There was no applause. The next one is Game Freak. I'm kind of not surprised. An obvious Pokemon is obvious. Yeah. Yeah. It tends to be oh, well, please. The next one is Sega. Like, uh, okay, can we have Shadow as an got, Echo finally, please? They got like 40 Metal characters you can pull fighter, from, and they're going to give you none of them. <laughs> I'll take Eggman, please. Uh, okay, the next one just throws me for a loop, but I do remember... Well, okay, I'll just say the company. Valve. Yay. This that is like means... the biggest what to me out of all of I this. I love Valve games. But here's the thing, though. It's like, even though uh, their games have never been on a Nintendo console... Uh, Gabe Newell. They worked with Nintendo. Yeah, they That's love. A, a they love Nintendo. Record. Gabe Newell has gone on record saying his favorite non-Valve game is Super Mario 64. Yeah. And there was a time where they even thought that they could put their stuff on the Wii U. That, that's also that's, made, that's right. Uh, you wanted Metroid Prime to be made by Valve. Exactly. They also made Steam games compatible with Nintendo Pro Controller. That's a lot of love. EF2 representation, please. please. It says it says right there though. Don't take any company listed as confirmation of their series getting a playable character. It is very important to keep that in mind. Yeah. It says this is the Smash fan base. Yeah. They're just gonna ignore that detail. <laughs> yeah, they're the best Smash fan. It, it's Smash fan CJ. They, all they see is a company list. Like <gasps> there's gonna be more than like. 11 characters? Oh my god. I Let's know. go. Look at all those characters. Another 35. Guys. We're gonna try and rival Tomba 2. What do you mean? <laughs> <I wonder laughs> that game is. Okay, the next one, so well, it, it says, uh, read. it says, please take heavy note that these can range from costumes to spirits to stages to characters. So some of them might be characters, but I think a lot of these are just going to range from spirits and uh, me costumes, which What's is perfectly What's interesting fun. is he mentions stages when all we've gone so far are stages with the characters outside I mean, people of are Battle suspicious field. of the stage menu, given that there's a yeah. couple blank spaces where the last one will be done. There are we'll three still have a few spaces left after the Fire Pass 2. I mean, so it's... unless they bring back stages from previous Smash games, they're going to be all brand new. I mean, if some of these do get characters, I would not. I mean, I would. I wouldn't be surprised if some of them did come with a stage. Let's let's say, for example, Activision there gets Crash. I think they'd give him a stage. They give them yeah. more islands, I guess. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but going back to Valve, though, I would be more than happy to see a, a Shell Me Gunner. I believe that's her name. Shell. Yeah. Oh, from Portal. Yeah. Portal? Yes. Yeah. C H E L L Shell. Uh, I want. I want TF2 representation. Dude, Scout Please? has a Me Sword Fighter, but it's a bat yes. instead. Yes. Oh, I would love it if they added the particle effect. Every time we get hit, someone it says bonk. Please. Bonk. Oh, how about uh? Bonk. What about like an engineer gunner? Oh, uh, I, like that. I can see that. Or maybe four yeah. because of the rain. Yeah. Uh, most of the TF2 people would be good. All right, and uh, the next one is, let's see, where was I? I was at Valve. The next one is Capcom, Capcom. which we okay. yeah we got me costumes and the, spirit, and a potential final fighter of Phoenix Wright. Yep, if and this the is Unless yeah. there's somebody out there who can tell us that there's another character 
That doesn't fit that description. Roll doesn't I'll... do action. <laughs> She's I'll from do... an action series, though. Worth... Yeah. Something that is worth noting is, out of all the Capcom representation, Ace Attorney is mysteriously missing. Because we have Resident Evil, Mega Man, Street Fighter, Monster Hunter. All no. of these represented with either stages, characters, assist trophies, and spirits. But Ace Attorney has not gotten anything. I'm just going to say, I actually would have thought he'd been a great me costume. But if he can actually make a, a playable fighter out of him, well, okay, let me see it. I, I want to see what he yeah, can do. Yeah, I mean, MVC3 did it, so it's not too much out of the realm possible. of possibility. Right. I mean, we did get Wii Fit Trainer, so I then, can't say anything, but it's just like... I was going to just say... Yeah. <laughs> I was just about to say that. We, we can get Wii Fit, Fit Trainer, we can get anyone. Well, going back a second, uh, Resident Evil, Monster Hunter, Street Fighter, and Mega Man are all some of Capcom's best-selling IPs. Ace Attorney isn't. It isn't, that but is it's, like a very well liked it's a very well-liked one. It's a very well-known. It's, it's yeah, beloved, it's really well but it is still niche. It sells less than DMC it's... and even Dead Rising. And I don't think it's Sakurai niche. cares. <laughs> I don't even yeah. give a crap about plus, that one. You never plus, know. Yeah. With Nintendo choosing the characters, they probably saw that uh, the new the the or eight, the eight, great Ace Attorney was going to get ported, so they're like, hmm, great way to cross promote it with uh, Phoenix Wright. Not Even though I, I know, like, it's not him, or unless they do, like, a hero thing where it's, like, multiple, like, attorneys they on could. the same spot. They could. Which, oh, that'd be neat. Maybe they just call him the attorney. <laughs> they probably nah. just have different colors of the other attorneys, like how Cody does with Street Fighter. I could or see they could too. do what the Kooplings do and have the different names for each alt. That. Oh, I, I mean, they can get away with that, but that is a lot of voice lines that they'd have to record. That unless is they're just. PW's the, plus, PW is the face of Ace Attorney, and there's only, like, four other pro, uh, defenses. Yeah. Which still theories. works. I, Which would still work. I could work. see, like, at, mo uh, at least Apollo Justice being an alt. Yeah, I, I, I think what? that's one of the safer bets on that one. Uh, let's see. We did Capcom. Next up is Microsoft, and. This yeah, is where it's yeah. strange. Like, this could either count as the Bethesda, what we just saw with Skyrim and Dragonborn, or, who knows, maybe Microsoft is really trying to negotiate and get Master Chief in. The next one does say Monolith, which, that could tie into the whole first party character that he was, or the, the, the not the first party, but the first character that he was leaking. Yeah. It's vague, but I it still fits. I yeah. mean, a Xenoblade 2 character wasn't too hard to predict, especially after we got an arms rep. And we did know that Sakurai was thinking about an arms rep and Xenoblade 2 character for base, but they just ran out of time for both. Here's the next one, though. Bamco, which is just Bandai Namco, which, once yep, again, we yeah, just got, got that right. Yep, yep. We've got costumes, we got characters, and we got stages and spirits out of them. And Lloyd's yeah. costume. And Lloyd's costume. <laughs> and Lloyd's. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, uh, the next one. Oh boy, just, just, just run. Just run. <laughs> I have no idea what to expect from this one. Run. It's Steel Wool. Uh, I'm already out of the country. Uh, this idea alone is more just like pushing it. Just like, hmm. Oh. What's a what's a game series that's popular lately? Let's put that in here. Yeah, let's put Five Nights at Freddy's on there. Let's do it. Yeah, that, that's, like they're, that's they're, it. Yeah, I mean, if this they... was like a spirit or a me costume, I'll believe it. I mean, given yeah, we've gotten indie representation, I wouldn't be surprised if we do get a Five Nights at Freddy's costume. Right. Yep. Or spirit. Yeah. I think it might just be spirits. I think yeah, that'd be yeah, hilarious. Yeah. Like Bonnie is represented by a purple Incineroar with a bunny hood. <laughs> <laughs> I can see that. Or Chica is represented by Falco. And then Foxy is just Fox with a bunny hood. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Yeah. On the pirate ship stage. Yeah. yeah. There you go. See, this is this is actually working for some stupid reason. <laughs> Fool, stop brainstorming. Sakurai will take notes. <laughs> oh, I bet watching this video is like, hmm, these Remember are good ideas. Well, 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 then you realize he's taking notes to dump them in an incinerator. It was like, write that down, write that down. <laughs> it's like the suggestion box gag from Gumball. The one where Gumball puts in a suggestion and it just goes down oh. into a paper shredder. Yeah, I remember that one. Where do I complain about the about this? Put it in the complaint box. Where's that? In the middle of a desert, surrounded by <laughs> skeletons. <laughs> okay, uh, the next one is Arc System. I'm That's one of two potential picks, then. 
Okay, but uh, I'm a little. I'm drawing a little bit of a blank on that one. Uh, who do, what does Arc System do? Guilty uh, Gear and Blaze Blue. Guilty Gear, Blaze Blue, uh, River Which City. Which both are on uh, Switch, but I don't know if they do that given that Strive has been hanging out on non Switch because Strive is very intense graphically. I would say Spirit or Me Costume. Yeah, I mean, we already have Arc System. Maybe some, maybe some songs as well, because Gigi's known for its music. Is that the yeah. one that has... Uh, Gigi would flip if that ever happened. Is this the one that makes, uh, or that has the character of Soul Bad Guy? Yes, yes. Soul Bad Guy from Guilty Gear. And the and head developer, Kaisuke, from... is also the lead composer of the soundtrack. I definitely see that being as a me costume. We do already have Arc System works represented through Spirits by Cats of River City, so it is... Um, yeah, that's very true. Kind of, yeah, mm -hmm. that's very true. Kind of easy to say, like, oh yeah, more Arc System stuff is coming because we I know there's a double dragon involved. in there that also counts. Plus, uh, Arc Systems is a big collaborator with Namco in general, so it's not going to be too surprising because uh, you know they did Dragon Ball Fighters together, and I think uh, in Europe they publish Guilty Gear games. Namco does. Okay, and then the last company on here is Konami. And yeah. I would I mean, love it if Konami, I would so. love it if they would just. I, why am I not f remembering the word right now? Updating or upgrading their something like that, or promoting promoting Bomberman to be a sister trophy to a playable character. It's so not going to happen. But what I think you I mean, mean you don't? You mean you don't want a Silent Hill rep? Come on. <laughs> I mean, at least at least he's on Me Fighters, DJ. I know, I know. Uh, how about a a Contra Me Gunner? Oh, that would be awesome. Oh, that would be They did be try cool. Contra. Robot Contra. Emphasis on try. But they did try. They're trying to get back into gaming after they completely crashed and burned because the pachinko market caught fire. I, I mean, <laughs> it's also worth noting that we still haven't gotten an Alucard me costume yet. Oh, yeah, despite, that's like, right. Uh, oh. So we could still get that. Yeah, I think you're right on that one. I think either Contra or uh, Castlevania with Alucard. Definitely a strong possibility. Now, those are the only companies that the person Ooh, has listed. What if they do Soma Cruz? That'd be cool. That's the, that's the lead protagonist of one of the GBA Castlevanias. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Heart of Sorrow and uh, also Dawn of Sorrow on the DS. Or, or right in from the Metal Gear series. Okay, now... Uh... <laughs> also, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, we got our PlayStation All-Stars rep. No. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> no, you can't. That, that Sony will demand royalties. Yeah. <laughs> Now, like I said, though, what I like about this one is that he doesn't... Uh, he's saying what he knows. I'm not saying that these are all of them, because Way Forward is missing from this. Yep. And Way, and Way Forward did the Shantae game, so with her me costume and that not being listed there, that means, yeah, this guy doesn't know. And he doesn't even claim to say these are all of them. He just says these are what I, what I know. And which gives me hope that there are more companies here that he doesn't know about, because... Ubisoft and Disney are not listed, and I would be very happy to see uh, Rayman and Sora get in. So, well, if he said here. Disney, it would be pro pretty obvious who it is. Oh, yeah. Yeah, like, yeah it's Mickey Mouse. Yeah, but he's leaking all this <laughs> stuff anyway, so why wouldn't he just go out there and put it out and put it out there? Because he doesn't want to get sniped by a Disney ninja. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I guess, the only thing, I guess the only thing more terrifying than Nintendo ninjas are Disney ninjas. The snipers from on the roof. Yeah. It's funny you talk about ninjas because I was just to talk about Tecmo, and maybe Ninja Gaiden could get some representation. Yeah, yeah it's like Ryu Hayabusa. Yeah. As much as I love Hayabusa, Koei Tecmo kind of hasn't cared about him at all. Well, they are uh, re-releasing the Gaiden uh, trilogy. They have, but lately they've been oddly focusing on Dead or Alive. Yeah. Yeah. Which he is mm -hmm. in, but that would mean Kasumi gets in instead as the lead because she's the protagonist of Dead or Alive. Uh, also, Can we yeah. really count that anymore? Like, does the yeah. does the protagonist really matter anymore at this point? Uh, there is no protagonist. protagonist the second switches his protagonist around. I mean, we so. got I mean, we got Min Min in, and she's she's not but even. But everyone's the protagonist. protagonist. Yeah, everyone's a protagonist. Even doesn't the, care about protagonist. Really. Main, even main even protagonist. though Doctor Coil exists, and that's basically the antagonist. But she's a protagonist, apparently. <laughs> yep. Yeah, also, yeah. Sephiroth, who is not uh, a protagonist at all. Yeah, but he also had Cloud already here. Right. Sephiroth he came here because he heard Cloud. Uh, I mean, Cloud <laughs> yeah, it's just weird. Like some, like he's a protagonist in the first game, and then he's like a villain in later tech. It's weird. Okay, so yeah, I, I, there are some companies that a lot of us would like to still see that are not listed. 
But once again, he's not saying that these are the only ones that are there, just the only ones that he knows of. And that's I do like that about some leaks. It's like, don't tell me everything. Leave a couple surprises. But give me like an indication of what to expect. No, you will see it here, 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 and here. This is what Sakurai's going to have for breakfast in the morning. This is what he's going to present at the hour, every hour, on the hour for the next three hours. Yeah. <laughs> Sakurai's going to have frost in many weeks. And then he's not going to mow his lawn, which is going to confirm Travis getting upgraded from character. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to happen one day, I swear. Ouch. Suda51 is probably Wait, still crying he about didn't it. cut his grass? I, it's grow vile. I think, no. I think it is... Uh, I think it is worth noting here, though, that out of all the comedies listed, Square Enix is absent, even though we know for sure that Square is involved. So They're involved, but be... they already got all their stuff. He said from this point onward, like... And... So that means, like, yeah, that's it for Square. Well, <laughs> for uh, rip, any, rip anyone who wanted Chrono Trigger. Darn it! Rip anyone who wanted Noctis as a me costume. <laughs> who wanted Noctis? I mean, hey, it's still, it's still a possibility that they could be in there and he just doesn't know we'll see i mean like, i've seen some people wanted knock this like people like, like 15 but it's not one of the more popular ffs true I mean, but, but i mean like, like people just want uh so something that isn't seven no you get more seven seven remake uh, seven, seven cereal seven seven is the only thing that exists and now for the last one the last note he has here before he checks out uh he says as far as concrete fighters go after the zelda one I know for sure the final will be... Oh, boy. And this is where it's like, this is a gamble. The final will be Waluigi. This that just, would be funny. This just he feels like a gamble. Time to shine. Please, I mean, no. I mean, to be fair, there was a leak that actually had Piranha Plant, and nobody believed that. True, but... Uh, I know, it's like, do we really want Waluigi? And I'm just saying, if he's funny, yes. If he's not, get him out. Go back to being make an assist you... trophy. Yeah. To, Just to make honest, me laugh. Like, would, That's all you gotta do. I, I would like to see him and like Sakurai like, just ignores like the, the meme inside of like, yep, yeah, it's him. <laughs> I see all that your post and we finally added him. No, okay. imagine the trailer. He shows up. The trailer ends. <laughs> he doesn't show anything. Just like, yeah, he's here, whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, he reveals that it's Waluigi, but the release date of the trailer is April 1st. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, the, the splash the splash screen is Waluigi time. Just kidding. <laughs> uh, it's fighting a player all over again. Now here's something that is a problem and another red flag. It says, "Yes, I know Sakurai is breaking his own rules." That's a red flag because Sakurai never said that was a rule. Sakurai, yeah. yeah. Besides, Sakurai is drawing him back on his words so many times, so it's. Well, no, no, no. The thing is, he's saying he's breaking his own rules. Sakurai never said like assist trophies couldn't be promoted. I think that's what he's trying to imply. Yeah, that's a fan rule. Yeah, the only one that's actually real is non-playable. It's non-video game characters. You have to be a game character and somehow have your franchise in some way on a Nintendo console. Uh, kind of. Uh, yeah, kind of. SMT's been on plenty, so it counts. <laughs> well, I mean, there's also Persona Q2. So yes, that's, and yeah. Q2. We now, knew that one went along with Joker. Yeah. So. Now, here's the yeah, thing, though. This but... is where he spec speculates on something. He says, and I heavily s suspect... A Fortnite guy will be the Please, first no. pass. Will be first no. after pass two, but don't know Please, for sure. No. This is no. that he doesn't believe the pass two is even going to be the end, even after the quote bonus character you mentioned. Yeah, and he's B, just saying like he's just like yeah, whatever. Yeah, he's just saying this like this seems like oh yeah, like guys, I got your attention now. Plus, like, he's he's just, I think it's a Fortnite a guy, but I'm not sure. He's, he's literally just throwing out a guess. He's like, eh, yeah, this this could happen. I mean, it could be, but I don't know. I mean, like, he has Epic there listed that, for though. a reason, but it could be like a me costume. It's Gears of War. What? <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Marcus no, Phoenix, uh, me, Gears, Gears, me Gunner. Yeah, Waluigi yeah, and then like, Fortnite guy, I'll be, uh, Jonesy, I'm like, no. No. <laughs> No. Then, then we know that Sakura is literally losing it. Okay, but uh, he just puts in what he, he wants. He says like the matter. final one will be Waluigi, and that the the, the, the he has yeah this... he says the final will be Waluigi, and then like oh uh, by the way uh, the Fortnite guy is coming too. Like oh no he says he, said, oh, he well. says that, but he's like I don't but I don't know for sure. So there's he's a little bit of wording unsure. problems here. This is like another yeah, red flag. Yeah, there's that's also yeah. he like, says I know weird. for sure the final will be Waluigi. Well, oh by the way, this guy. 
Why do yeah, there's also oh, but, but, uh, Yeah, it's like, he says, oh yeah, he's the final, but maybe there's a Fortnite guy. Look, I know it's Waluigi. Okay, how do you know? Well, my uncle. Oh, here we go. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> this old story. His sources are dude, trust me. I mean, in all honesty, uh, do I want this leak to be real? Kind of, because it means more characters are on the way. Even if it means Waluigi and even a Fortnite guy are on the way, it means there's still a chance to get more characters even though no, nobody else is really listed, but it does mean like more characters could be coming on the way. If, okay, if it means the more possibility of Sora, fine. I agree. I'll yes. have to suffer through Fortnite <laughs> and Waluigi to get to him. Fine. You could <laughs> just <laughs> not buy them, dude. Jeez. A small price to pay for salvation. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's like a small price this to pay for This is a game Sora. with over 80 characters from over a dozen IPs, and everyone's like, I know. oh, fine, I guess I'll sit through another <laughs> brand new character. Yes. <laughs> it's like, oh, guys, we're, we're, we're at 90. Come on, we're at 90 first. Come on, guys. <laughs> My ice cream Sunday only had 39 cherries. I asked for 40. Get out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's, uh, let's just move on to what I think is probably like the final thing here is like, do you think this is real? And we'll go one at a time so we don't start talking over each other. Uh, Joker, based on the evidence, based on what the guy has said here, uh, do you think this is real or do you think it's fake? Like, do you think the the too many red flags say there's too much, there's some suspicion going on here, and he had some lucky guesses, or do you think that because of the dates and everything else lining up, do you think this might actually be real? I okay, I won't say that it's true, but I won't say it's neither like. That they're lying about it because this is like Smash we're talking about. Anything could happen. I mean, anything. Well, that's a nice happen. vague answer. So, <laughs> it's a nice vague answer for a yes, for some of the vague guesses. Okay, but yeah, if I get a vague leak, it's a vague answer. It works out. Okay. Yeah. Okay, but if I had to choose one, I, I would say they're lying. It's fake. Smash Mario Pro 2000. Your guess. I. It's hard to say because it is possible that he just guessed all this stuff and just said oh and just worked out for him especially like with the ex how he was portraying himself like oh guys i want to be famous guys I, I just don't that just get, was like a red flag to me like but that's also something like a leakers do because they just want attention that's yeah. why like the guy like the esrb guy was like <laughs> did what he did and it turned out to be right but I think what is concerning to me is like, firstly, I, I just, I just think like Sakurai being so adamant that this is the final character, that means like, yes, this is, I don't think the whole, we're getting characters past the past is kind of true. I mean, a bonus character is, you know, likely because, you know, that site, we have evidence at that, even if Sakurai is like, kind of, it's, I think it's subjective yeah, evidence. But, it's subjective, yeah, but then, like, he's like, but then this guy's like, oh, yeah, I know for sure, like, we might get more characters past Fire Pass 2. Uh, I just don't think that's true. I think he may have been, like, because this is something that some leakers do. They give out real information and then give out fake information to blend in with the real information. Which is like, why would you do that? Yeah, uh, if you have information, why not just, and especially with this. Out. Especially with this guy's like being wants to brag about it, like, you know, yeah. why would you then lead us on for false information? So like, I'll believe it when I see it. Like, okay. I'm more of a, I think it could be real, but like, I just want to see like if the last character is for sure a Capcom character, then yeah, I'm gonna be team real. Okay, actually a bit of both. <laughs> like looking at the information, like the date and what he got right with Kazuya and and Pyra and Mithra. I want to say he got a lot of things right, but I also think he could get some stuff wrong in the near future when stuff like Waluigi comes up. Like, who knows? For all we know, the last character could be Wiggler from Mario to, to match Piranha Plant. <laughs> Very well could be. It's it's like that uh that image. What is it? The ten blind men and the elephant? That's what leakers are like. They have, like, very little information, and they don't get the bigger picture. Pretty I'll putting, much. I'll be putting up the image so people understand that but that's kind of what it is i'm uh, pretty much with smash mario on this one i'll believe it when i see it okay. and let's not forget even the most credible leakers can get stuff wrong because look at vergaben oh he, yeah he, he, absolutely yeah. vergaben even though he got some stuff right he's also got a lot of stuff wrong oh uh, he did not get a lot of the dlc right at all base game yes oops 
DLC, no. Although he was eventually proven right about Steve, but well, there was more stuff he got wrong than right in the DLC. And, then, and, uh, and even then, it's kind of like Gamatsu getting Krom right. It eventually happened, so... Yeah. I guess. Okay, now Sub-07, what is your ver verdict on this? So, my philosophy on leaks has always been the same thing since the last, like, five years. All leaks are fake until proven true, so I'm mashing down as hard as I possibly can. <laughs> if it's true, impressive. I also don't really care, because we passed the threshold of me caring a long way back at about 60 fighters. <laughs> Why should I be throwing a fit if someone else from another IP I don't care about gets in? We have so much. Who cares? Fair enough. Honestly, it's more like, uh, for me, I'm 45% saying this is fake, 55% saying it's real. It's not that far off. Like, I do think it's more real than fake. Like, uh, the date on here, that was for me what cinched it. He, it's not, that's not fabricated. You can find this, you can find the exact article. It hasn't been touched. It's still there, posted as it said. It's gotten so many things uh, right, even though they're kind of vague, but he does give off some exact details that go, okay, yeah, he, this does make sense. He was right about this. For example, he did say it was a less expected rep of, th of a third party that was already in Smash. That's a lucky guess. Uh, and then, you know, uh, the Pyramithra won't break the internet. That's a lucky guess. Uh... And then also it was just the fact that he brings up the potential care the, the potential bonus character before we found any kind of subjective evidence on it. It's like this is just too much. And also the Monster Hunter costume and Dante. People were pulling for Dante, and Dante became a me costume. You don't just say that just to upset people if you really want to be taken serious. He wanted to taunt Camilla. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so. However. Oh. Uh, yeah, I'm just saying like. I think a, up until the end of Fighter Pass 2, I think he's probably right on the money. But anything else after that, I kind of feel like he's throwing guesses out there because notice how he does not say any of the characters na by name in Fighter Pass 2. But when it comes to after the Fighter Pass, he does list off the names. Yeah, I was actually going to bring that up, okay. but it just slipped my mind. Also, yeah. something I think a lot of people... A takeaway is that um, when it comes to him guessing Pyra and Mithra, well, Concert Leak was around at this point, and that was saying a Xenoblade 2 rep. So he may have used that as a springboard and just guess at the other two. Yep, uh, but so far he is right, and I still think it's like it's the potential bonus fighter and the Dante Mi costume. That basically just sense that just like almost cements it for me. Like I, I'm keeping it. Th the best way I can say this right now is keep an eye on this leak. Whether you believe it's real or fake, I think this is one right now that is worth keeping an eye on because it's gotten so many things right. It's got a number of red flags, but nothing that has been proven wrong at, at the moment. I'm surprised Camille didn't block Sakura on Twitter after he showed them Dante Mi costume. He probably did. <laughs> <laughs> like uh, my character to me costume blocked. Well, he probably went away. Yeah, one for one. I'm good. I, I, it's really hard to say what Sakurai is gonna do because yeah, he's been so completely adamant that this is it. This is the last character. But then again, where's that? There's that subjective evidence for a potential bonus fighter. And it's like, well, what about that? Doesn't that count? Oh yeah. <laughs> the thing is, like, even if he he's saying like, there's one more, there's one more, there's one more. But when you're trying to present a bonus, an extra, you want to keep that as a surprise. So you don't say anything yet. So, I, I don't blame him if he's trying to do it like that. But then what do you do at the end? And as I mentioned way earlier, that I had a tinfoil hat theory about what could really be going on here. Uh, and once again, this is like, stretching. We know Sakurai can't work on Smash forever. That's, that's an impossibility. As much as some people want him to be going through essentially slave labor for it. Please don't. No, he, Let the man he's a poor guy a break. The thing is, he's mortal. He can't literally work on it forever. N and Nintendo obviously knows that. But they can't give up Smash just because Sakurai's not working on it. I just not don't so see that happening. They probably just have someone else as a protege of him Ex for that. Exactly. Yeah. And that's what I'm thinking. Like, maybe he's. Maybe they're actually testing out DLC after Fighter Pass 2, if this is real, as a way to see how well the guy can handle it for the next Smash. That could work. 
It also mm, depends yeah. on who it is that they're talking about. Because if, if it's someone who's already worked on big projects, they probably already trust him enough. Exactly. But I think it also has to be somebody that, you know... Okay, they're not going to tell us who would, who would who it would be right away. But if Sakurai says, I trust this person to take over... And we can take, we can trust that. That's like one of the, that's like one of the only few statements from Sakurai I feel like I can trust. <laughs> I but. trust this man will do a good job with Smash. This man. How about a localized Mother Three? <laughs> oh. Yes. Yes. The promotion. That is a good job. What's the promotion for this guy? <laughs> it's like the people who thought that Doug Bowser wasn't going to do a good job after Fizume, and then someone was like, "What if he did this?" <gasps> okay. So, uh, any other closing thoughts before we before we end this video? Nothing that I can think of now. Nope, I got nothing. I think we all just gave our thoughts. <laughs> I mean, hey, I I, I thought the Grinch leak was real, but I didn't go after anybody saying it was fake. So I, I'm saying I think this is some this is more like a little bit more real than it is fake for me. But it's something I'm gonna keep my eye on. It's not saying like, oh, this is 100% gonna happen. I'm keeping an eye on this. All right, well, I think that's pretty much all we can cover then for this one. Uh, real or not, let's see what happens. I, I honestly think whatever this is... Whatever happens, happens. Yeah, whatever happens, happens. Uh, and, if you blow, and if you blow a fuse because X didn't get in, just remember, stop. <laughs> yeah. yeah just stop. Me. <laughs> I mean, you're, you're... Yeah, like, if you're going to be upset with Sakurai, I'm sorry at this point. You're just mad. He's giving you the world, and you're complaining that you didn't get the galaxy. Yeah. Like, just, like, it's okay to be disappointed, but don't be angry or hateful about it. All right, then. With all that said, I'd like to thank you guys for joining on here, and I'd like to thank the viewers for watching. And with all that said, I'll see you guys in another video. Later, everyone! I'll see you all on the wild side. Adios. Did we go home yet? Later, everyone. <laughs>